Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti from AnthonyMorganti.com. Recently, there's been a bug that has been introduced for Mac users in the latest versions of Lightroom 6 and Lightroom CC. And I've received an email uh, probably every day on this bug, and I thought I'd just do a quick video to talk about the bug and show you a temporary workaround that you could use until Adobe gets this bug fixed. The bug concerns the targeted adjustment tool. And as far as I know, this bug is only for Lightroom 6 and Lightroom CC users. Specifically, I'm using uh, Adobe Photoshop Lightroom CC uh, version 2015.10.1. And I'm using OS 10 Sierra version 10.12.5. And specifically what the bug is, is if you use the tone curve, or the HSL panel and you want to get a targeted adjustment by clicking on the little tool right here you'll notice you'll click on it and it looks like the tool is active but when you're over the image you don't have the tool it's not there similarly if you go down to the HSL color and B&W tab and you click on the targeted adjustment tool you'll see the tool isn't activated it's not there and you really can't do a targeted adjustment now a temporary workaround for this is Whenever this is happening, and, it, and this is actually kind of intermittent, sometimes it'll work and sometimes it doesn't work. Most of the time it doesn't work. When it isn't working, go to your HSL panel and try the tool, click on it, see if it's activated. If it isn't, go to a different tab. Right now I'm on the Luminance tab. I'll click on the Saturation tab, then I'll click on the tool, and the tool you could see now is activated and I could actually use it and I'll go back to the luminance tab and you can see it's working now once you do this often it will keep working at least for the session you're use, you're currently in on the image you're currently doing sometimes it'll stop working when you switch images and once you do that it usually will keep working then on the tone curve as well so you can come into the tone curve and do things targeted adjustment wise there as well so it isn't bug. Uh, from what I understand, Adobe knows about the bug and they're claiming that the bug will be taken care of in the next release of Lightroom 6, Lightroom CC, whenever that may be. Until then, hopefully this workaround helps you. That's it. Thank you everyone that watches my videos. I truly do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon.